Hi guys, Grant here. So today I'm going to be talking about GTA 5 Ill Gotten Gains Part 2 and all of the new or some of the new stuff that is coming out with it and has been confirmed with some new pictures for you guys. Before we end the video, if we can get 234 likes, 234 likes, that would be awesome. And also question of the day is how much do you think Ill Gotten Gains Part 2 will cost in total? Part 1 cost, I think it was about $21 million. I did a video on that. Link is in the description. Anyway guys, let's get into the video. So first off, you can see in the background there is an image of the ill Gone Gains Part 2 and you can see one of the new vehicles on there. But let's go on to the other images first. So first off, we have the stylish coil brawler and it is equipped to handle any terrain. So it's basically an ATV and all-terrain vehicle. And it looks kind of weird but cool at the same time. I don't think Rockstar have really done some cooler tuning and color coordinating options on that particular image, but it does look pretty cool. Next up, we have the Lampadati Toro, which is a new, uh, quite nice looking boat made out of wood i think next up we have loads more clothing and accessories as we obviously get them every dlc but there you can see a new jacket there looks nice next up we have the invetero coquette blackfin and it has a new body style on an old favorite i'm sure a lot of you guys will know uh, which car that is i'm pretty sure it's the lampadati casco um, but basically with a different sort of body on it. It looks like more like more like a Morgan body, if you know what a Morgan is. If you don't know, you can just search. Next up, we have the one-shot Marksman pistol, and this is going to be awesome, a one-shot pistol. Hopefully, it won't be overpowered, but I doubt the range will be too long. Next up, we have one of the new supercars, and this thing is called the Progan T20, and it's built from the ground up for quick getaways and street tuning, so I think this car is going to be pretty sick. Next up, we actually are going to have knuckle dusters from now on, and you can pick these up from Ammunition for a new way to connect with uh, all your friends and enemies, if you get what I'm saying. Next up, we have the Vapid Chino, and this looks like a bit of a baller car, looks pretty cool hopefully we'll have a lot of tuning options on it and then finally we have a super bike a very fast bike i'm assuming because it does say luxury meets raw power with the dinka vindicator and usually the dinka bikes are quite quick and this looks pretty sort of futuristic and very very quick guys i will leave a link to this article and everything in the description down below i hope you did enjoy if you did drop a like and thanks for watching this is granty peace out